prestigious occasion. Once again, I welcome you all. Welcoming the guests of our country, especially to our state. It's my privilege to welcome our chief guest, secretary, principal, HOD, faculty, and my dear friends. May I now invite M. Keshavika from second year BCom to welcome the gathering. Good afternoon to all and are present here. It's my pleasure to welcome you all to the role of artificial intelligence in the current scenario. Industries organized by Department of Commerce, Adhyaman Auto Science College, Pavarman. First, I would like to welcome our principal, Dr. S. Thirumal Murugan sir, who is the real person and support to achieve great success in our academic events. Welcome you, sir. I extend my hearty welcome to our secretary, IAC president, Dr. Jane Shobha, ma'am, who plays an important role in our each and every moment. Welcome you, ma'am. On behalf of Department of Commerce, my warm welcome to our chief guest, Dr. Sreeven. Department of Commerce, my warm welcome to our chief guest, Dr. Sreeven Kateshwar, Associate Professor, Maharishi Markandeshwar Institute of Management, Maharishi Markandeshwar University, Mulana, Haryana, India. Welcome you, sir. My glad welcome to all students and faculty. Thank you. Well, I feel so happy to extend welcome to all. Once again, I welcome you all. Thank you, sister. May I now invite Vishri Gayatri from second year BCom CA to enter the guest room. Dr. C. Venkateshwaran is an academician and management scientist specialized in human resource management and industrial organiz organizational psychology. He is also a consultant psychologist. He is a man of knowledge in various disciplines, a critical thinker, problem solver, solution maker, and a good communicator. His Excellency doctorate, doctorates in business administration, education, and post-doctorate in literature. Master's degree in management psychology, sociology, labor management, philosophy, religion and culture, social work, education, guidance and counseling, political science, public administration and so on. To gain wider perspective knowledge to focus more on human resource management and industrial psychology. He has over 15 years of core academic experience along with 10 years of part-time industrial experience. In many academic institutions, he handled the, the role as a placement and NAC, AICTE, and UGC coordinator, students and faculty counselor, trainer, and students' welfare coordinator. He has traveled throughout India and abroad, like Singapore, Malaysia, Australia, and Thailand, to many educational institutes and corporate companies with new management ideologies, especially in human resource management, human resource development, and organizational psychology. He is a proud member of Rotary, MMA, FICCI, CII, and so on. Many awards by many organizations and associations have been presented to him, acknowledging his credentials. He has written and published more than 100 articles in many reputed national and international journals and published books. He has organized and attended hundreds of conferences, seminars, and training programs. He is working for many innovative projects with suitable patents and copyrights. As a PhD research guide, he has guided and guiding many scholars to explore their innovativeness through research in management studies. He is very fluent in English, Tamil, and moderately in Hindi. On the outset, he has contributed his learning and work experience in shaping and igniting the students, research scholars, life, and the society in all possible avenues. Welcome, sir. Thank you. Thank you, Sri Gayatri. Now it's time to start the session. I request our today's resource person uh, to start, Dr. Dr. C. Vengateshwaran, Associate Professor, Maharishi Margandeshwar Institute of Management University, Maharishi Margandeshwar University, Mulana, Haryana, India. Sir, now the session is yours. Thank you. First of all, I thank each and everyone who have uh, gave this great opportunity to me and coordinators, all the faculty members, last but not the least, all the students who are going to get inputs from me and uh, eagerly waiting uh, with great happiness to get a lot of exceptions from me. Thank you. Thanks for each and everyone. Uh, before initiating the session, 
I would like to give some small introduction for what is artificial intelligence. Uh, somebody who is having PPT can even play it. Yeah. So, as you know, the topic is the role of artificial intelligence in the current scenario industries. So, from the if you talk about these all things and which will be strongly connected with this. Once the world has formed very beautifully, a lot of uh, amoebias, a lot of small, small features for many, after many four years, it has been formed. It's uh, at a time to know about the small history about the geography. After that, a lot of like small, small reptiles like, uh, like cockroaches and small, small insects has formed. After that, birds has come. After that, animals has come. After that, we people, human being has come. And the next generation is going to be machines. That machines are also being formed. It is our next generation, right? It has to come. We cannot stop it over. Yeah, can you hear me? Yeah, no shoes. Can you hear me? Can everybody hear me? That's great. What? Can you hear me clearly? Is it okay? Hello? Can you hear me properly? Yes, sir. Great. So, sir. like year by year, the planet is totally changing, as we know very well about it. So, as I told before, first reptiles, after that birds, that birds only converted in the uh, way of living. It has just took one one next is creature as animal. After that, animal as as we know very well, human being being evolved from the animal called monkey, right? After that, human being is now creating, trying to put all his, what he can do, and which is called as artificial intelligence. So some question may be there with uh, some of the students, sir. Why I should know about this? So what is the benefit I'm going to get through this? It will be a good question. I'll answer my PPTs and my explanations will make you understand where the world is going and what we are doing now, what we have to do next that will help our career perfect towards. Right? So, uh, look at the PPT. You can see here the yes, first slide. Sir? Yeah. So, will you please yes. change the screen to landscape mode, sir? Uh, actually, it's being played by uh, one of your coordinators. Uh, it is in the control of your coordinators only, ma. Yeah, yes, sir. Understood. In projector way, the mm. students is in the uh, class, sir. sir but uh, in our side, we felt like that. Is it okay, ma? No problem. Just uh, we'll manage. It's no issues. Okay. Okay, sir. You may continue. Okay, ma. Show the first. No issues. Show the first slide. Kindly show the first slide, ma. Okay, enough, enough. We can go, we can scroll it slowly. Okay, no issues. So, as you know very well, the topic is the role of artificial intelligence in the current scenario industries. Before stepping into this, we have to know what is artificial intelligence and what is industries, how both are connected. And because of these two collaborations, what are the benefits that we are getting? These two, these two things we have to uh, know. First of all, artificial intelligence is all about as a psychologist, let me tell you first, what is intelligence? I always tell to my students to know the differences between few things like our knowledge, our intelligence, our brilliance, cleverliness, these all things, presence of mind, these all things, right? And then brilliance, how excel we are in showing that intelligence according to the city about the cleverliness, doing the things smarter, smarter or extra smarter, like that together to complete the task. 
if 10 people joining or 20 30 people joining together and completing one task people joining or 20 30 people joining together and completing one task that if only one machine can do means definitely we will opt for that machine right so that is the plan of this artificial intelligence the natural intelligence that we have is not sufficient the natural intelligence that we have is not sufficient for the work to be completed. I want to construct, for example, I want to construct the building. So I want to complete the construction just in one month. I need to construct 10 floors. It is possible, but not in one month. It takes its own time, like three months or six months or one year like that. That is the time duration we can expect to get completed. But I want in one month itself, who can do? Human cannot do. We can assign machine. Machine can do very perfectly. So a lot of machines I'll be purchasing and I'll engaging those all machines under the supervision of human being. Like how you are using span. You might have watched the movie Three Idiots. Right? Three Idiots in Hindi and Nanban in Tamil. In that movie, they used to say one, whatever the machines, what sorry, whatever the material that reduces our work, which makes comfort to us, can be called as machine. Why is human do, using the machine? Putting the fan because we need air. We cannot keep on doing this. Right? Why we are using vehicle? We cannot run faster like that. Vehicles are helping. Why we are using flight? Human cannot fly as of now. Right? So we need some machines. What is machine? It's a set of system. This, this particular many materials join together to perform something. What kind of performance that we have to decide accordingly we will keep the materials inside for example to say i'm using the material for washing machine i want to put the clothes and it has to be washed and it has, it has to come out okay such like i'm keeping the material for fridge i want to keep the things inside and i want to get the things freeze i'm using it chill whatever it is according to the climate according to my need so fan different ac different so all the materials Machines, all the machines we are using according to our convenience. If you have that speaker, if you are giving that information, I want to play this particular song. If I'm saying, Alexa, play this song, I'm saying the, from the song from the movie Titanic. It is finding and it is playing. I'm not doing anything. So it is making me to comfort, feel comfort. I'll be sitting somewhere and speaker will be somewhere. I'm telling something voice recognition through voice recognition. It is finding the keywords of what I'm saying, finding in the internet and bringing it and it is playing. So these all functions are happening. So I'm feeling very comfort for that comfort. I'm in need of artificial intelligence support. Okay. So they gave an introduction about me. So I'm moving to the other slides. You can see here the capacity helps that helps and supports us. The capacity given by humans to machines to memorize and learn from experience to think and create to speak to judge and to make decisions. Many decisions we are unable to take us in the normal brain. So we need some super brain support. So we are looking for that, which is artificial intelligence. See, some people, this is about artificial support. My eye needs some extra support to look at the things properly. So I need mission, so called as artificial support. It has lens, adjusting my eye power. The same for that. And in other words, artificial intelligence is the ability of machines to perform tasks that are typically associated with human intelligence, such as learning and problem solving. We are learning many things, right? In life, we are learning many things. Join together in one particular mission and we are requesting some work. Sorry, we are instructing some work to the mission. If it is completing it in five minutes, if it is completing it in five minutes, which human do in 30 minutes or even two, three days, even some data processing needs one week, one month. It will be completed just in five minutes. That process will be over. Telling once again, some data processes to be completed by human being, it takes one month, even two months, even six months also. 
to find the where the mistake is if any mistake is there or any particular things that we didn't understand so we need to work on that to clarify that after that getting signatures after that uh, re-verifying it and adjusting that according to the requirement these all things takes much and much of time but whatever you say artificial intelligence will complete this all process just in five minutes so much of my time is saved time is not only time money for corporate people each and every minute counts it's money so machines are helping a lot and machines doesn't do any strike or any problem that normally human being do because human being has problem with emotions and feelings machines doesn't have that right it will work or it will get failure but it will not create any problem right so that is the thing that is very big advantage we no need to fight with the people machine doesn't create any problem in between will not do any strike or will not say that i'm not at all interested to work like that whenever we are switching on whenever we are putting off the whenever we are giving the instruction it will start working that's all these are all very good advantages of machines especially artificial intelligence right then who found this great invention john mccarthy he is the father of artificial intelligence right where he comes from and he is a great innovator in the field of uh, he is actually from like computer science that is he is a computer scientist actually he found lot of things related to computers maybe softwares hardwares whatever required for the daily usage of even he worked with the microsoft company also if i am not wrong he gave lot of services and lot of applications which can be used very easily so he is the person he is the father of artificial but he is the father of traditional method of artificial intelligence okay so you can see about him in the next slide you can see about the elaborate information about it he is a computer scientist american he is an american and he is uh, he worked for he, he made his career in stanford university you can say many things about him anyway as of now he is the father of basic father of artificial intelligence after that the new modern father has come like jurand sumisabeg this person this person has worked out lot of things in the existing projects and he is making lot of things he is also like alan mas many people sorry many people working towards many new things to make us easier without cell phone now you and me cannot talk without proper internet connection you and me cannot talk without proper application of google you and me cannot talk like this thousands of things even you can say lakhs and lakhs of things are joined together that is the reason you and me are sitting and talking like this see there is no wire wireless material right so each and everything is been coded is been done for the benefit of people every new invention will be better very nice if we know how to use it in the appropriate place i repeat once again please listen each and every invention each and every material or machine whatever it is if we are using it in the proper way it will be effective no doubt on it negatives will be there in each and every machine positive and negative will be there for sure no doubt on it at the same time if we know how to utilize that in the proper in the proper positive way then that you cannot expect any comfort any way that is for sure so we have to see about the goals of artificial intelligence uh, you can see that slide goals of artificial intelligence few goals of artificial intelligence are they like number 1 neural networks that is what are all the neural connections that we can make with the machine and what are all the neural system you know you might have seen in the movie robo they used to say what is the neural schema of that can you tell that that is a brain right some people may be knowing about neurology right it's all about the connection of nerves each and every nerve now i am want to move my hand i am doing how it is happening it doesn't have any here how it is happening my brain sending information to Okay. Just one minute. <clears throat> My brain sending some information to the hand, to the leg, like that, and it is working. 
right? And I want to move my fingers also to the maximum and my leg fingers, everything. It is happening. How it is happening? Because some connection is there, some through, the, some, through some connection from my brain, information is passed through the nerve and it is reaching that particular organ. That organ is working, which is called as neurology. That is neural, you know, or whatever, neural networks we used to say. These are all the base. You might have, for example, for your better understanding, you might have seen a lot of chips, IC chips, right? You see, you see say ICU, whatever it is. A lot of connections will be there. It will be like this. Right? Each and everything goes in their own way, their own track. It will not change. Right? In that way, the information will be gone and it has to reach the motherboard. It has to reach the particular area. So that area, after that, the information is passed from the software. It will work by itself. So neural network. Network is everything in communication. These are all things are communication. Next is planning. How, what kind of design? You, might, you can take everything reference with that movie. Right? First, he will plan what that humor, a lot of uh, robots are there, a lot of artificial intelligence materials are there. We are going to discuss types also. So, humanoid robots, what that material, what that machine going to purpose? What is the purpose of that machine? First, we have to be very clear. Like washing machine? Okay. It has to do like this, spilling and food, crushing it over. Okay. Everything okay. What about the... What about the vessels and everything? What about the vessels? What about the car, vehicles, everything? What it has to perform? Excuse me. The close. Just one minute. Yeah, sorry for that. So, here that planning is all about what kind of material we are going to use, what is the purpose, how the machines to be made, and what kind of material we are going to use. You cannot use the material of washing machine to that vessel cleaner. That is different. This is different. Like that. Even the vehicle itself, how many differences we have? Right? The small vehicle, big vehicle, comfortable vehicle, uh, luxury vehicle, sophisticated vehicle, a lot of things are there. According to the content, it, the input will be. So here, planning is very important for artificial intelligence. Robots are being made, soft robots to help only at house. You might have seen some, uh, even in the, at Chennai also I've seen in one hotel, uh, servers are totally robots. They are, it is coming and it is serving the material and it is saying thank you and it is going. It doesn't know more than that. If you ask like Rajini Gandhi, it will not dance, it will not fight. That robots don't know anything about these all things. It know only these all things. In such a restricted manner, only the program has been written. Program has been instructed. So you should be very clear kind of planning what kind of, uh, what, for what purpose you are going to use that robots. I mean, or artificial intelligence materials. Next, you can see robots. What is that robot? Robotics. Humanoid robots or whatever it is, as I told sometime before. Next is machine learning. Machine learning. Many people don't know even about the digital. We used to say digital platform. What is digital? How it has been made? Many people don't know. What we are using in the internet is digital. That's what we are thinking. Of course, it's digital only. But how it has been formed, that we have to know. If I am saying hi, if I am typing hi and sending to somebody, to the machine, it will not go hi. It will go like 11001010110, like that 0001. Number two is 0011. Important. Especially it's also getting involved much, right? These all things you might be learning. Right? So what is the purpose? What is that actually? What is that machine language? Why we should do that? We need to understand the machine. Then only we can give the instructions accordingly. If you say, please stand, machine will not stand. It don't know what you are saying. The language it will not understand. So you should make that relationship you have to make. You should make that machine to understand what you are saying. So come on, get up. If you are saying like that, come on, get up means you have to hold, you have to get up like this. These are instructions you have to frame, you have to give codings. So it will perform accordingly. Next is natural language processing. The same, what I told now. We, what we are using is a different language. What machine uses is a different language. Both should sync. If I'm talking in English, you should. I should be very sure that you will be understanding it. Otherwise, I might have spoken Tamil itself. 
right so i should be very sure that you know the language english otherwise no use of talking in english the same right the next one you can say perception perception is a meaningful sensation meaningful sensation means five sensory organs we have eyes nose ears you might have studied in organizational behavior subjects eyes nose ear tongue skin these all things are machines don't have that you might have seen that the movie there is no emotion for that right it will bring one uh, lady without dress in the fire situation and will, every that girl go for suicide then that person will educate the machine you should not do like that there is something called self respect there is something called a uh, conscientious feel and everything then he will insert those all right so perception is all about we are judging something through our sensory organs and we are doing that what i'm trying to explore to you it is perception perception is an assumption only it may be true or it may not be true right the stages are there first step is assumption second stage is perception and third stage is about prediction and the fourth stage is about judgment the fifth stage is about decision making and final stage is about implementation after implementation also we need to recheck whether we are doing the content properly or not is it correct or not if you feel anything wrong you need to come back we have to check and we need to redo it again right so next is knowledge knowledge the word came from knowing the things no knowledge knowledge knowing about many things in life of course we need to know many things but we have human have the uh, limitations to the capacity like we don't have extraordinary thought like albert einstein some people have some extraordinary people have even i know personally now also recently one great person from india achieved right the chess he he shown almost about the fear of defeat to the number one player of chess these all people are like chai prodigy some extraordinary people right knowledge from the beginning itself so these all things comes to the machine through us so we are giving knowledge for uh, who is having hundred of people having thousands of people what they can explore what they can do one will be expert in dance one will be expert in bit singing one will be expert in playing cricket one person kabaddi one player each and everybody have lot of talent and skills if all the talent and skill join together and being programmed and given to one particular machine think about the power of that machine and i will repeat once again if you give thousand people their talent and skill to one particular person okay expect lot of miracles and even unexpected many miracle will happen definitely for sure so next is about so this is about knowledge next is cognitive system cognitive in sense your brain process is called as cognitive how your brain thinks even we don't know right many times we are thinking something and we are doing something i want to take this pen i'm going outside i want to take this pen before uh, leaving this place after 10 minutes i'll be going after going some to some distance i'll be seeing that oh i forgot the pen my brain itself not listening to me what i'm talking right it is cheating me or it is not working properly these all things are happening so to make machine to understand what to be done what should not be done we should be careful cognitive system entire intellectuality you are going to give it to that machine right so i repeat these all things just think about it neural networks planning robotics machine learning natural language just excuse me time journal if we see about the time journal of this we'll go a bit faster because a lot of things are around 40 page types are there so i'll go a bit faster i request all the students and all the people to make notes if any something may be useful at any point of time at any uh, any any course right you can make note it may be useful to you so when you talk about artificial intelligence time journal you can see autonomous systems machine learning deep learning neural networks like pattern recognition natural language processing and chat boxes real time emotion analytics virtual comparisons real universal i'll tell these all things just in a short considering the time constraint see yeah so 
each and every ingredients each and every characteristics of machine will be designed by human what the machine should be performed what the machine should not be performed the instructions will be given these all things is based on learning if i don't know about something i will not do that if i know something i may do i may not do i'm knowing i, I know something and i want to do it and i'm expertizing in that every each and every day so i will be expert in that I, it may be good or it may be bad whatever it is just give me one minute time yeah so these all things we have to decide what is the limit and what are all the things it can perform what are all the things it should not perform we have to fix it properly and we have to follow that fixation that is important that is safe for us okay next in another form we are discussing about artificial intelligence is the branch of computer science that studies machine intelligence machines intelligence that's all. human intelligence is different machine intelligence is different machine is a artificial one we made that it will not make itself right but if you are giving knowledge saying that how to make another machine it will make and it will create threat to human creature also that also we are going to discuss next we we'll do for example search engines in google you are going that right? you are searching for some song which you like i told something before titanic song okay i'm putting t it will show the list next t i i am typing so it last something titan watch no i am typing again t titan no t i t e then n titan titan leak n i c titanic film movie titanic songs everything will come how titanic song everything all the connection film when you are typing it, all these informations are coming all the suggestions are coming how it is happening which is called a search engines search engines will help when you are typing something it will are you searching for this no okay next letter are you typing for this one you are searching for this one yes okay then click it i'll give the information to you for that the first speed is important guys one more thing i forgot to tell you machine the advantage of any machine is time and accuracy also i want i want to switch on the fan i'm switching on slowly it is starting after one hour only it will work very fast no use before that i will leave this room itself so speed and accuracy which human being cannot do right what are all the things human being can do that we can perform we no need of help of machine to this machine will do for this process that machine will do this process for example think how many of you uh having practice of sitting down or walking practice everything in the morning you see we are morning getting up we are doing machine bathing everything standing only it just think standing okay after that uh you just taking the car or whatever it is you are going to the office or you are going to taking two wheeler you are going after that sitting on the chair only you are after that you are eating that is also on the daily table only after that evening you are going to and you are sleeping where is the work for your leg in this way do you give work for your leg why because of machines everything is machine right artificial intelligence can be used whenever wherever it is required in your life also i am telling the same got it ah uh, search engines so when you are searching for something best cricket team at mumbai i want to know i want to take i need to know best uh, cricket team in at mumbai i am putting that it is showing these are all the things okay how do i know because search engines are working it will search and it will give the information to me so my job is easy even for this presentation also i for search engine help me a lot google help me a lot to take it over right next is like content recommendations netflix youtube you are watching it always right netflix and youtube what all the contents which you seeing in the theaters that has been come to now in your hand itself right this all things artificial intelligence help us there without that it will not happen and you might have seen more than 1 million likes 
now the next movie is going to be the actor vijay's movie right leo the competition between leo and the jailer which is coming who is watching which trailer has gone much how many millions it has gone that we are saying it's that has no mass for that search engine cells you need to keep on advertisement in your phone each to your phone all the advertisement will come first time you will not see second time you will not see third time you will click and see what it is then one view over these all things artificial intelligence will do you may ask why it has to be done market money commercial things yeah itself i'm talking about how they are getting what they are doing what they are investing applications Okay, they are using some softwares plus your time. Your time is the main source. So next, self-driving vehicles. Tesla has some self-driving. You know, no driver required. It will manage the rules and regulations. In our in our country, it is difficult. We don't know what is the rule when it has to be followed. Like you might have watched the movie The Same. No bone when the car is going. It will not obey the order. It will just go. It will hit somewhere. and somebody will be asking that give something like that police will be asking like that it has made in this only but self driving is the next thing nowadays automatic washing machine automatic car self driving car has already came to india it will reach us very soon for just very less amount of 10 lakhs or 20 lakhs very soon nothing wonder on that how it is working it should know how to judge other vehicles to know about gps is there from one place to another place it has to go by itself it can go by itself it can manage no issues at all after that what is required road management okay driving management road discipline knowing about the people and driving speed limit these all things everything is programmed now human being just need to build other all things machine should do world is going like that only. So next, you see automatic language translation. I see somewhere, especially I'm in North Bay. Whenever I'm going somewhere, I cannot talk in Hindi or Punjabi or Haryanvi or Bhojpuri. Those all things are very familiar. Those all languages are very familiar here. I cannot talk in anything here properly. So what I can do? I need something when I'm going to shop. I'll put the translation. I just I want this. I type and I put it convert that in Hindi. It will talk by itself. Voice also there. It will talk by itself and give my my work over. I am still not learning Hindi or any other North Indian languages. I still not learned to the expert. Just I know like butler Hindi, like that only, because of machines. So who is making me lazy? Who is making me careless? Machines. i am adapting according to the mission i am getting help from mission any time i can get it i am getting and i am doing that's all so next you can see. so automatic language translation these all are very helpful we cannot say no if i am going to say okay here our indian people okay we are talking we are having good fun everything fine if i go to china if i go to japan or if i go to any other country even some audience watching from japan also here okay so if i go to some other country if i need to talk to them how i can talk i don't know the language even at least i can manage here we need no problem we know it's our national language you can manage about other country so these all things will be like great gift for the people who are got struck will be having that experience they will explore it next is face recognition facial recognition here also in our college or many other institutions you can see institutions or organizations you can see many cheating there in the signature and everything right face recognition is important it counts about your pupil your, your pupil moments about the thumb impressions everything's are there nowadays right so it's all our about biometric biometric bio means in a sense your biological and metric means test biometric right face recognition through that lot of uh, benefits you can get safety purpose especially safety is important twins are there twins may have same face they cannot have the same pupil moment i mean pupil they cannot have the same biological intelligence right biological content so it changes next is computer games operations also like military i mean it's like game only you need to go and you need to attack that means it should go and attack for that human being cannot do and most of the times i i tell you in military also people using artificial it's a great blessings for them he can avoid human losses if one robot has Killed means it's okay. Mission has gone. You can make it again. If one human died, that family will suffer a lot. 
at many places this artificial intelligence is a very big blessings at the same time if you are not used artificial intelligence properly it is going to be it will, it will put end card for human species next you can see and ai is a computer system that performs tasks that usually required for human intelligence we need some extra intelligence i said told before and i'll go a bit faster with this i given an example of an artificial intelligence is siri people who are having uh, apple phone they may be knowing about it siri open it call that person everything will be seeing it will do right call mummy call daddy it will do that voice recognition is being done you know this also you watch in the movie shivaji you say hey cool but you that rajini used to say na rajini khan as, as shivaji used to say hey shivaji cool but you open that it's like that right voice recognition other people also try the same the wordings are wrong and voice is also wrong some people talk really like rajini also rajini khan also but words are wrong so the voice tone about the mood of a person and about what the wording he is using how he is using the slang everything will be observed and kept in the machine that will help for safe safety and security purpose and in that movie itself he used to say it's a self respective after three times if you are using that if you are telling the code wrongly it's a self destructive it will burn by itself it will destroy itself this all also artificial intelligence who told that system to get totally spoiled that is self destructive instructions been given so artificially that intelligence gives information to the person don't do this first time second time third time you might have seen it on the atm or somewhere if you give wrong instruction after two three times it will get blocked it will get locked and you need to go to the branch manager and he will remove it with your with your request right these all things so it these all things based on the statistical analysis algorithms and even some derivative concepts also got it so next is about cousins of artificial intelligence i don't know whether you all seen this ppt or not um Uh, dear admin you have to come before you have to come before the cousins of artificial intelligence you have to come before 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 please come yeah still 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 just yeah, stop 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 this one this one ah this one okay from this you follow me okay thank you so cousins of artificial intelligence that is artificial intelligence is a program can sense reason act and adapt it can understand you what you are trying to do what it is required what you are expecting these all things how the instructions that you are giving i already told about machine learning so you can go for first uh, you can go for next one deep learning about subset of the machine learning in which the multiplied neural networks learn from vast amounts of the data data maintenance is a very big problem for management people you all are into management right management into business studies business management or commercial pcom mcom data maintenance is very difficult actually many people in the name of data analyst data scientist this what people what they are doing that you think they are maintaining this is all each and everybody's data for some purpose i'll give you a small example to you You try this. If it is required, definitely it will work. Keep your phone near to you, and talk about something like um, uh, Maruti Suzuki. Talk about Maruti Suzuki. Twenty times or thirty times you tell that Maruti Suzuki, Maruti Suzuki, near to your phone. You should not. No need to do anything. Keep the phone. That's all. Talk about that. You see, in after thirty minutes or before that itself, you can get all the. advertisements related to maruti suzuki company or android whatever it is you already given the permission you can use anything any of my photos any of my your full phone your full phone is not in your control first of all you understand that you are talking about maruti suzuki okay one time it will note one time he told that second time third time he is telling 10 times so he is going to purchase that vehicle like that it will be so immediately this number person again and again talking about maruti suzuki that particular product 
so he may purchase that so the two that is the lead lead of your number your name and number if possible your name also lead name number your gender your age if of course you are already given all the details through facebook and linkedin everything has been already given right this is the data of a person he may be looking for a car please talk to him like that that data will be sent to maruti suzuki company maruti suzuki or any other company like that and that person they will understand one person will be sitting i told na data analyst he will understand okay this person looking for that one say which one what we can do then to this number we will send the information for that intermediate also will be there like agent will be there to put the advertisements to this particular number it will come and reach us so these many things are happening in this small process in what way it is useful because we are looking for car to purchase in maybe we are getting the information that is very nice in another way it is difficult to handle because all the messages keep on coming it will be disturbing us and one more thing the banks request no banks are very secure and safe but if we are if there somebody hacking the bank accounts like that i lacks in our phones please give the list this thing that the bgd the software that offer all things will come right so this all the process of artificial intelligence next types of artificial intelligence let me go a bit faster because very less time is there almost it is 3 o'clock from itself let me go a bit faster because a lot of slides are there still it is right based on capabilities narrow artificial intelligence super artificial intelligence and general okay just you see these all things are for learning so important things yet to come about the industries okay so these are all the types i'll share this ppt to you you can get it from the concert people even if you want you can even uh, message me also i'll send you no issues you can see it over next is like uh let me go to uh admin please go to artificial intelligence in industries artificial intelligence in industries you should cross five six slides so that you can find artificial intelligence in industries see industrial artificial intelligence can be embedded in stuff so to avoid those all accidents and everything machines are the correct Excuse me, sir. Yeah, I'm here. I'm here. Just one minute. Can you hear me? Everything is okay. Hello. Everything is okay. Yes, sir. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. Yeah. So, in many places, many fields like in hospitals or in the. manufacturing unit or any other companies any other software companies whatever it is they are using artificial intelligence as the main source in particular company before 5000 employees worked for the process now only 500 employees are working that 4500 employees sent out instead of that person they are using machine why benefits are more than human being human being they get into strike Are into problem something else, but machines it will be perfect. It works or it will not. It will lose its 
process and we do not do anything else. That's all. You can understand this is the problem. You can solve these problems and we can find and we can solve it easily. Right? So we can go next one. Some actually I prepared a very big slides for you. So we did have very less time, only 15 minutes, 15 and 20 minutes only left for this. So we'll go a bit faster. Okay. I'll get into this. I'll show this slide you can see from here. You can see here. You can come to this slide. Admins, you can change this. In fact, of industries. First, tell industries which is being in this. Which industry using artificial intelligence more you see? It's healthcare industry. About 15 percentage. Uh, the technological oriented companies, cyber security, real estate, energy, energy means like uh, uh, you can say electricity, manufacturing, these all things. Edtech, that is edtech means education, and last is pharmacy. So these are all the major industries in the field, right? Those are all industries they are using this 15 percentage, 14, 13, 11. So overall, healthcare is in number one, you can see. The main reason why healthcare industry is number one, many operations, many sensitive operations in the heart, in the nervous system, these things that human cannot do. Human being cannot perform such critical operations. So it is out of our practices. You will be thinking that pilot is sitting and driving, he is taking care of the flight. No, there is no this. Okay, me or both flight. I'm talking about trainings. In train also autopiloting is there. That is the reason now are very less. What has happened some uh, months before in Bihar? That is very unfortunate actually. It may be technical fault or whatever it is, but very less number of accidents are happening nowadays because on those days human error will be there. You might have seen always the flag and everything. Only. Artificial intelligence will help us like anything for our safety, for our benefit, for our comfort, luxury, everything it will do. But at the same time, we have to be very conscious in operating it, knowing about it. That is that's much essential. Okay, so first is healthcare industry. Many very big operations, very complicated heart operations, lungs operations, and especially brain operations is being done by artificial intelligence very successfully which even human beings cannot imagine to do that operation that machines has done. But money will be more because we need to hire the, uh, we need to design that and we need to implement and each and everything, right? It will be more, but operation will be successful. Then human machine will perform very good. People is properly. Next is retail marketing, Amazon, you know, immediately how you are getting this, how the control room is getting information and how the train is being stopped, saving the passengers. This way only. Got it? So these are all the important things we have to discuss definitely. Next is manufacturing company, cars and everything. Now you can see everything is molding. Even computers on those days, you can take everything. After that, they'll be like changing that also. Right? Very spare parts will be available. Nowadays, spare parts are not available in even computers and everything because everything is molded by the machine. Once it has gone, you have to throw it. That's all. So, so it's if you see that even uh, integrated circuits, you used to say IC, no? everything is being molded by the computers. All the computers itself made by computers only, with the design of human beings. Even human being is getting a lot of uh, benefits through machines, especially in militaries, especially in army forces. Next about cyber security, you know very well. If any person showing the face who is not related with that business, not related with that company, immediately so it is rejected. If again you show information will be sent as a message to the owner for safety. Each and every field nowadays using artificial intelligence. So uh, even for sensors also, you know, small example, like you're going to some place. I'm showing your hand. Just one minute.
Yeah. Right. So just in uh, five minutes, I'll complete it because uh, all the topics almost be covered. Okay. Main benefits of artificial intelligence that we have to discuss is reduction in accident. Many accidents have been avoided because of this great technology called artificial intelligence and many operations. Human being cannot do few sensitive things which machines can do. We are giving our knowledge to that machine and we are telling it to do this work. So, these are all the benefits we are getting more and more from the industries. And those days, to purchase one car, to purchase, you can see, 300 cars, we need to wait for six months. Nowadays, for 300 cars, we can make it in one month itself. Car uses are more, right? Everything is getting very easy now. Because of help of machine. We used to say this as real-time machines. Real-time machines. So, how artificial intelligence to be managed properly, that also we have to know, otherwise we will be in trouble, right? And goals in artificial intelligence. Guys, uh, how many, I don't know how many students watching this, how many experts watching this. Please learn something. Lot of courses are available, free courses even available through IIT, IIM. You can search from internet, you can take. Please do artificial intelligence course. You can understand many things and you can predict the world where, where it is going on. I always used to say to my students, know about philosophy, know about history, that makes you to understand today. If you understand history and today, you can easily predict tomorrow. So tomorrow is going to be fully artificial intelligence, domination and influence. If we don't understand artificial intelligence, our survival and our career will be doubtful. Okay, then... You can see this all PPTs. It shows about how the manufacturing is being done with the machines. You can see this car manufacturing, right? You can see no human being is there. All the cars have been manufactured only by the machines. So the work will be done very speed and with proper accuracy. No mistake will be there. Human accidents mostly because of human error only. Nowadays, we are avoiding it. And I have to talk about the military also. Right? You can see in which way they are using it. For the welfare of the system, strategic decision making, data processing and research, combat simulation, target recognition, threat monitoring, drone bombs, cyber security, transportation, casualty, care, and evacuation for our own Indian Army. They are using it for such purpose. Right? So these are all lot and lot of benefits. About this also, you can see. About the operation of artificial intelligence in military forces. Okay, so we need to say about what are the disadvantages there, right? With that, we can end it up. And one more topmost companies in this industry, you can see all the industries are using artificial intelligence for their own purpose, right? So it has been clear that it has to be done. It is required. And number one country in artificial intelligence is presently, any guess? Anybody want to give any guess? It's United States. Okay, India is uh, not in the list, the, the basic list, in the top 10 years also. We are going very faster. And limitations, which I have to say, it is very important, just for five more minutes on this. Remarkable, yes, we have to say about the limitations. Limitations means problems that we are facing, that limits that artificial intelligence what you do. While AI can perform specific tasks with remarkable precisions, it cannot fully replicate the human intellectuality. Exactly, it cannot give what we are thinking. And it cannot understand the emotions and conscientiousness. Somebody helping me 10 rupees. That person is in trouble. I will give 100 rupees again. Sorry. 10 rupees, okay, I'll give 100 rupees, whatever it is. Because 
gratitude. He helped me when I'm in trouble. He now I need to give back that money to him, right? But artificial intelligence will not do that. You give it a hundred rupees. You ask him, please give me a gift. It will not give because it doesn't know about the emotions and feelings. It's been coded. It's been given instruction according to the code. So limiting its understanding. human experiences human expectations we cannot completely expect from the machine that is the reason in the movie robo aishwarya rai will not accept the proposal of that machine right whatever i am expecting you cannot give you are a machine i cannot marry the machine like that she will say these are all the limitations okay and benefits and disadvantages pros and cons what are all the pros reducing human error human mistakes will be avoided allow for quick in quicker make decision making some decisions we cannot take very faster for that machines will help us reduce the risk risk of we are, we are taking some decision in that risk may be involved so that machine will take care of it automates the repetition so repetition whatever the things that we are doing we don't know we may be making the contact if you are saving the contact number itself we will be saving the same person's contact number two three times but it will say already you are saved you can see in your phone right that one assist with the digital tasking you cannot do any digital task only artificial intelligence can help you in the digital tasking these are all the advantages slightly come to disadvantage it necessitates higher overall costs money will be more required for that it causes jobless yes unemployment problem will be more lack the ability to be creative you will you will feel very lazy that's all machine will do everything so you will not do you will stop learning everything i told sometime before we are stopped going for walking itself now right that's one lack the ability to be creative next emotional range it says in there i told already emotions feelings machines don't have inability to integrate ethical principles it will not understand this is ethics this is not ethics if somebody saying to kill it will kill it will not see it is a brother or sister it will not see anything there is no any sentiments for machine these are all the disadvantages and about the future is going to be 100% artificial intelligence in all the industries so from now itself you get ready and you can achieve many things in life finally the conclusion the conclusion part you can uh, that mean admin can bring the conclusion part keep that slide yeah so machines are born to comfort us please everybody look at it it will be useful because it's a concluding whatever i told i just finished off by saying few important points to you machines are born to comfort us and our jobs the use and scope of artificial intelligence don't need a formal explanation for the more so artificial intelligence is no more just a buzzword it has already become a reality that is part of our everyday life we have to live with human you have to live with the artificial intelligence whether you are liking or not liking you have to live with artificial intelligence it has become like that right so the companies are building intellectual intellig i mean intelligent machines for diverse applications right it is evolving business sectors never before manufacturing or for business or for service what the word it is if you are taking the car for service also there artificial intelligence is there everywhere that is there right so these are all the things where we are using maybe maybe medical or maybe in the military or normal natural life as a end user we are using whatever it is the next generation is going to be the influence and domination of artificial intelligence so learning about the techniques learning about the basics of artificial artificial intelligence will help you whatever field you are in you may be in even agriculture i didn't talk even you are in agriculture also artificial intelligence things have been applied now the machines are going it is doing all the process and it is coming back without food we cannot live Artif already agriculture field is getting down nowadays because of sorry uh, agriculture field is going very down nowadays because of the special knowledge so called as artificial intelligence again agriculture field will come up and it will flourish like anything once again so concluding this speech saying whatever field wherever field you are in definitely help of machines especially artificial intelligence is must so start learning that that helps your life in a better way thank you
valuable time we have learned a lot about artificial intelligence thank you ma thank you so much thanks for the opportunity we have a formal vote of thanks sir i would like yeah, to thank you please ma may right ps ashita from first year bcom to deliver vote of thanks We are immensely grateful to the institution for granting us permission, permission to organize this enlightening on the role of artificial intelligence in the current senior industry. We extend our heartfelt gratitude to our esteemed guest speaker, Dr. C. Vengateshwaran Sir, Assistant Professor. Your insightful words and expertise have lasted a lasting impact on all of us. Thank you for sharing your valuable knowledge and inspiring us with your passion. Your presence has truly elevated our event, and we thank our participants for. joining on the role of, role of artificial intelligence in the current senior industry we appreciate your active participation and enthusiasm throughout the session your presence made it truly engaging and